Hello everyone. Have you listened this name Cotton University? It seemed like uh, cotton, but this is I don't know uh, what's the reason behind this name Cotton University. It is in Guwahati, uh, Assam, and the place is Pen Bazar. Actually, this is a state government university. That's why I'm sharing this notification. This is a recent notification. So if you are interested to join in a PhD program where net or JRF is not the main eligibility criteria, then you can go ahead. There are a lot of disciplines or departments with respective faculties. You can check geology, economics, education, history, Assamese, Bengali, Persian, botany, EBWS, MBBT, zoology, chemistry, physics statics got it so these are the number of seats which are available in these faculties and departments so if you are interested then you have to follow the ugc norms according to which the eligibility criteria is your masters with 55 percent marks plus relaxation to the category students so if you have that then you are eligible for that now the next important thing is that the selection will be based on the mcq or omr based entrance test so they are conducting the entrance test which include uh, two parts research methodology and the subject based test. So you have to fill the form very carefully followed by the Viva voice 30 marks. So each dis dis uh, discipline will contain this. So a total uh, marks will be calculated on the basis of your entrance test and interview. Then you will be selected for that. So final selection will be on, uh, on the order of merit based on the total marks obtained in the interest and in the Viva voice. Now the Test will be divided in the two sections. That is, the fifty percent of the research methodology, the fifty percent shall be the specific subject of your master's degree. So, accordingly, you have to fill research methodology is very important part. It was common for all the students who will going to appear in this test. But if you have net and slate, then you will get a five percent relaxation. It means fifty percent marks you have to secure. But in case of net or slate, forty five percent if you will secure in the entrance test, then you will be qualified for that. Now, if you have fellowship or scholarship, UGC, NET, CSIR, NET, or if you have any national level test fellowship, then you are allowed to appear in the Viva Voice. It is up to you. You want to appear in the entrance test, then you can, but it will not hamper your marks. Your final performance, your final merit will be based on the Viva Voice only if you have a fellowship or a scholarship. But if you have a net or slate, then you will get an additional 5% relaxation. That's it. So this is all about. And the mode of application is online. 28th June is the starting date and the last date is 23rd of July. So please be careful. The application fees is little bit higher, 1200 rupees. You can pay online through any mode and the venue of entrance test the, this, this this will be the definitely the question of the many uh, viewers who want to like know sir what will be the venue the venue is the cotton university so you have to visit the cotton university anyhow for the entrance test so this is all about very short very concise if any additional information is required so please comment in uh, comment or join the telegram group to clear your doubts or confusion before filling this form or any form there are a lot of fellowship lot of options for the phd scholar so explore as much as possible before taking your final decision thanks a lot have a nice day bye bye take care